This will be a short video how to factory reset an HP 1810 switch and also how to access it after you have reset it. Let's dive in. Have you tried turning it off and on again? All right, so here on my desk I have an 1810 HP Procore switch and with two pins like this we can hold in reset and clear. Then we let go of reset and we still hold clear until act FDX this LED start to flash. We then can also let go of the clear. Then we will wait a bit and we can see that the port 1 to 8 will start to light up and then it's gonna do a bit of a waterfall with the LEDs and now it's actually a factory reset. So we are not only going to factory reset it, we are also going to access it. So let's get a standard Ethernet cable, no special cables needed here. And plug in, in one of 1 to 8 Ethernet ports, it doesn't matter. And the other end into your computer. In my case I have an Windows 11 laptop. So Let's swap over to that one. Here we right click and go into network and internet settings. Hit up ethernet and we are going to set the IP assignment. We will edit this one and instead of DHCP we are going to set a manual IP address and check IPv4 and the IP span will be and the IP span will be 192.168.2 so anything in that IP span for example .123 subnet mask will be uh, slash 24 and that is 255.255.255.0 we don't need to fill in gateway or DNS just to be on the same LAN is enough so hit save then we can close out of this one and open a web browser and the default IP address for this switch is 192.168.2.10 so here we are in the web GUI of the switch password is no password at all default so just leave that blank and press login the web GUI will load up and this is a quite old switch so nothing fancy here but this is it we have now reset the switch. You can see the uptime is only three minutes and we are inside the web GUI. If you go about and do some setup, yeah, for example, in this little guide here, get connected and set IP, etc. Don't forget to also go to maintenance and hit save configuration. That's it for today. Please like the video it was, if it was helpful and subscribe for more videos like this. Bye bye!